I've rejected a long time ago that the only purpose of the criminal justice system is to punish. Voters in Philadelphia have chosen a progressive as their new district attorney. The most stunning upset. Sending political shockwaves across the country. I am a career civil rights lawyer, the only attorney in the history of this city to overturn 800 convictions by corrupt police officers. Krasner is a hero to some and a bum to others. He's never been pro-law enforcement. If things aren't working from the inside, you need to bring someone from the outside. What do you think he's trying to accomplish? Anarchy. At this point, there are more people of color in prison or on parole than in slavery at the end of the Civil War. Larry is bringing in criminologists, activists. Everything we do, steady fire, heavy resistance. This will be controversial. Policies that focus on rehabilitation and second chances as opposed to punishment. We're in Philadelphia and there's murders and robberies. Community service is maybe not appropriate. This DA's office has been too close and too cozy with the Fraternal Order of Police. How corrupt do you think the city is? Anybody who's dealt with this office knows there are secrets. We need to find out where the secrets are. You gotta be kidding me. What is it? All about police officers. There has not been prosecution of police misconduct by this DA's office for 30 years. Right now, Philly police officers think the scales are suddenly weighed down in favor of criminals. If you're too corrupt to testify in court, you're too corrupt to patrol the streets. Who was DA when there were dozens of people shot over the weekend? I was. We're tight, and we want our neighborhood back! When you try to make the right decisions, I'll live with the rest. There's a meaningless, endless cycle. A cycle of trauma, a cycle of pain. Some of the effects can be irreversible. There's no mass incarceration. That's utterly ridiculous. Not one cop is going to tell you that he's on our team. Well, I suggest you don't shoot unarmed people in the back. The DA's office is not a place a social experiment should be conducted. This is a movement, and all great changes come from movements. 